In this video, we are going to discuss about IP addresses, their composition types and classes available in the IP addresses. So, before deeply going into the IP addresses, you should be knowing about this common terminologies. What is a bit? A bit is a single digit with a value of 0 or 1s. What is a byte? A byte is composed of 8 bits and what is octet? Octet is also composed of 8 bits. Coming to network address, this refers to the remote network in the terms of routing terminologies. So, coming here you can see the examples of all hosts in the remote network fall within this addresses. For example, 10.0.0, 172.16.0.0, 192.16.0.0, 1.0. So, these are all the remote network addresses and all the hosts in the remote network fall within these addresses. Coming to broadcast address, we all know that broadcast address is the address used to send all the data to all the hosts in the network. You can see an example, the broadcast address 255.255.255.255 refers to all the hosts in all the networks. While a separate, we can only separate it to address such as 192.168.1.255 refers all the host in a particular this network. So, you can see 255.255.255.255 refers to the broadcast address which in which is in the all host in the all networks, but particularly to one network all host connected are take an example of 192.168.1.255. This is called a broadcasting address. So, coming here, the IP address is 32 bits in length, which contains network component as well as the host component. To make the address easier to read, it is divided into 4 octets. Each octet is having 8 bits in comprising of. So, each section is therefore 1 byte, also called as octet long. That means Four, com four it, it is divided into four components or four parts. Each part is of eight bits, also called as one byte. For example, an IP address such as all this binary is divided into this four parts, and this is again converted into an IP address. So when this address is converted into decimal, you can see 192.128.12.1. So, in the next slide, we will be looking about how it is getting converted from this binary to this decimal point. So, this format of IP address is called dotted decimal format. So, how this is converted? You can see easily see here, it is easily converted from binary to decimal and add up the decimal values corresponding to the bit place which is with the one letter. So, here take an example. So, this is 10110000 can be easily converted to decimal by adding the decimal value where 1 is noted. So, that gives 128 plus 32 dot 32 plus 16 is equal to 176. So, the decimal value of the most common binary numbers you will encounter. So, you can see here this is related to this one. So, how it is converted into decimal dotted part. So, you can see here how 128 has come here. 128 is for this first number. So, as we already discussed that wherever 1 is noted, so we have to calculate that part. So, we have to ignore the 0 part. So, here 128 denotes 1 here and you can see at the 64, uh, 64 is 0 here. So, that next one is 32. So, 32 is calculated. So, same way the next one 16 is 1. So, 16 is calculated. The rest all 4 zeros and these are all comes into 0. So, this is how 167, 176 has come in place here. So, you can see here how this binary values are converted into decimal values. You can see by the previous one, the first one is 128. So, 128 is the value here. So, coming to the next one, 11000000. So, if you add up 128 plus 64, then we get 192. The same way when you calculate all these things, so, you can get the decimal value of the binary value and also you can see an IP address does not only represent the host address. So, as I, as I discussed previously, IP address has two parts, one is host component, one is network component. So, in fact, network host and resides both on the host itself. So, you can see here in the IP address two parts are network and host component. 
So defi this defines networks or subnets in the inter network where the host resides in and also the host component it defines the host itself in the network. So combination of this network component and host component both comprises of the IP address. So coming to the classifications of this IP address, these are classified into class A, class B, class C, class D and class E. So what is class A? Class A has the first byte which is of first octet in the network component and the remaining all the host components. So as I said the IP address is divided further divided into four components. So the first one is the network component and rest three components comes under host components and class B the first two bytes that means the first two octets comes under the network component the rest two comes under the host component. Coming to class C the first three octets comes under the network component and the last one comes under the host component and class D used for multicasting and also class E is reserved addresses for the military departments etc. So that these are, these are not used in the real time network environments. So these are the classifications based on the networks and host path so that we will be discussing about these classes in the next videos in depth.